Hey guys, welcome back to Food Tech Journey. Today we will be discussing GAP or Good Agricultural Practices. So, these practices are crucial for ensuring food safety, environmental protection, and sustainable agricultural production. Without further wasting time, let's start. The definition of good agricultural practices basically these are a set of principles for sustainable and safe farming it covers soil water crop and worker management it also ensures that the food is safe and it is impacting on sustainable farming basically gap aims to produce safe food while protecting the environment One food fact for you that the GAP guidelines are based on the Food and Drug Administration that is FDA. Now, what is the purpose of GAP? So, the main purpose is to fulfill the trade and government regulatory requirements which are mainly for food safety and quality. You can also understand it like this that it can give you a path so that you can export your vegetables globally and you can ensure that the, that the food is safe for consumers. Now, what is the importance of GAP? The importance of GAP cannot be overstated. First, it ensures the production of safe food by minimizing contamination risk. Second is, it helps in protecting uh, natural resources like soil, water, biodiversity, and ensures long-term sustainability. So it helps in protecting environment. And lastly, by adhering to GAP, farmers can gain access to high value markets, that is international markets, and improve their profitability and competitiveness. So the market access is what GAP will provide them. Now, there are four pillars of GAP. First is food safety and quality. Second, social acceptability. Next, we have environment, environmental acceptability. Last is economic viability. In further slides, we will be discussing on these four pillars of GAP. Starting with food safety and quality. So the practices that are include are safe handling of food, minimizing contamination and Increasing quality checks so that the final product is safe to consume. The benefits are that it ensures that food meets safety standards and maintains consumer trust. It helps in maintaining integrity and to trust product. Next is social acceptability. Uh, in farming, it means treating workers fairly, ensuring um, they have fair wages, and the safety of the worker is also monitored and taken care of. Um, another practice that is involved is community engagement. It means engaging positively with the local community. The benefits include uh, that the labor rights are respected, promoting fairness and safety in agricultural operations. This also includes fair wages, maintaining hygiene and creating a healthy environment. Next is environmental acceptability. So uh, in environmental acceptability, the practices includes uh, sustainable practices like uh, conserving uh, sustainable resources like water and maintaining biodiversity and reducing waste. These are the practices that are involved. The benefits are for the environment that it protects the ecosystem and conserves natural resources. It also ensures that uh, soil and water are protected for future generations. Next is economic viability. So uh, the farmers can sustain their livelihoods by producing profitable and marketable crops. It means that they can have the market access 
that is to the global market and ca they can improve their productivity and gain access to high value market by following a uh, gap farmers can boost profitability while also meeting sustainability at the same time it can make their business more resilient in the long run that is more profit and sustainability of farm now uh these are those four pillars we have discussed already there are few processes that are involved in farming that must be taken care of so one of the critical stage is harvesting and post harvest handling so the goal one is to improve practices like we have to harvest timely using clean tools and proper storage should be done that is maintaining proper temperature proper uh, environment another goal is to maintain quality and reduce spoilage because if you are going to use clean tools and you are going to store the food properly then definitely the quality of the product will improve and spoilage rate will reduce and we can get more profit proper handling ensures product safety and quality another most important stage is to record keep to keep records and traceability traceability is where you can recall the product if a batch of product is spoiled or causing uh, severe uh, allergies to consumer uh, the practices involves documenting inputs water test and traceability records it means uh, from the first stage to the last stage till we are providing the food to consumers all the records including batch numbers and vendors data should be maintained the benefits will be it will ensure transparency and accountability in production increasing to profit again so good records ensure traceability and safety another most important part is certification and compliance you must have heard about global gap so global uh, gap is the certification is a standard recognized uh, certification which ensures that farms uh, farmers comply with food safety and sustainability requirements this certificate gives farmers access to international market and assures that the food they are buying is uh, prepared responsibly it means quality assurance the benefits definitely international markets and consumer trust certification ensures adherence to high standards people will believe that you are following correct methods and uh, you know correct practices to prepare their crop as we all know challenges of implementing gap are worldwide first is lack of knowledge and access to technology local farmers and small scale farmers are having uh, less access to technology and lack of awareness is uh, really challenging for implementing gap also high cost there are we all know that there are uh, various new benefits uh, for gap but we have to train and support small farmers so that they can have access to technology and can learn to implement gap and have profitable business so these challenges uh, have solution that we have to implement in order to maintain and implement gap worldwide in conclusion adopting good agricultural practices is essential for sustainable agriculture ensuring that food is safe to eat the environment is protected and farm workers are well treated so the future outlook would be to increase global adoption with the help of technology gap is really essential for a sustainable agricultural future so we must all help local farmers and small scale and large scale farmers to adhere these practices in order to implement gap worldwide one homework for you guys dash is a festival of sowing seeds in the field this festival is originated from jharkhand options are given please uh, comment your answer uh, in the comment section if you have any doubt you can ask if uh, you want to reach us out you can mail us on foodtechjourney at the red gmail.com keep spreading the content guys and help us in growing and reach the ones in need thank you very much once again
थैंक यू